Is it going to drop us in? Okay, so it's going to drop us in, and we're going to see this freaking... What the charm was going to be. It's going to be bad. I know it's going to be really bad. Okay, let's go. All right, all right, all right. Okay, so um, I'm not calling anybody out. Somebody in chat said that it was cavalry classes first and knight classes second and then DB. Hey, Karu, welcome, buddy. Welcome, welcome. Um, it is knight classes this round. <laughs> I'm not gonna, let's just do this. Oh, I forget to hit the speed up. Sorry about that, guys. All right, so, um, all right. Uh, Arash's NP is gonna obliterate the saber, Lancelot. Uh, if I use the waiver 20% team instead of just Arash's, um, which now I wish I had put. Oh man, I'm dumb. Uh, no bad. No 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 uh, worries on custom. So we'll, in hindsight, what I should have done is put devilish bodhisattva on a rash. Uh, do I have that? I don't. I actually don't think I have devilish bodhisattva on this account. So disregard. If I had it, I would have put it on him. Use his battery. Use waivers twenty percent. I actually think that I have devilish bodhisattva on my other account. Not this one. Ignore me. I'll shut up. Anyway. The question now is, do I NP here with um, a rash or with Spartacus? I think I'm going to do uh, a rash. And I also think I'm not going to use uh, waivers 20% on him. Because I don't think a rash can take out David. And I want David gone, because if he, if he hits his party wide evade, it's just going to be annoying. It's just going to be annoying. So we'll do Spartacus first. Because I know... Uh, because of Lancer, yeah. I know that Arash can take out Lubu in the second wave. I know he can do it. He just has to survive that long. And as long as Diarmid doesn't just go ham on Arash, which we'll pop this just to be safe. Level 1, that's fine. It's, it's more than nothing. Um, as long as Dermot doesn't go ham on a rash, he should be okay. He should be okay. So, let's get, uh, Spartacus doing his damn thing. And there we go. And actually, we're going to get a nice buster chain here. It's not going to matter because it's on uh, the Lancer, but it is what it is. Um, just to make sure, not really make sure, but just to try to make sure that David is gone. It's just his party-wide evade. That's the only thing that's on my mind right now. But as you'll see, my Spartacus, uh, he does work. He does work. You went after David first round too. It's a smart play. Uh, all right, so now uh, Young Master Arash is gonna trigger a Buster Chain. We've had really good luck in this fight so far. We got one charm. We had a Buster Chain first round. We have a Buster Chain this round. Things are things are going our way. We're gonna trigger this useless skill. <laughs> It doesn't do anything for me. It gives me like five extra stars at, at, at the most. And check some stuff. We're good for now. All right. Who do we want gone? That's Edison. That's um, Blackbeard. Lubu is going to be gone no matter what. So let's do this. Let's split it up. Uh, I, don't, I don't remember Edison's skill set, but uh, Blackbeard's can be kind of annoying. So... We'll do like this. Because I know Lubu is going to be gone. A rash also hits pretty hard. Uh, in fact... 
Yeah, we're good. We're good. This is going well. This is going well. All right. Now we need Spartacus to GTFO. Uh, uh, that's actually not bad. That's not bad. So we'll use this on her. We're also going to get this Arch Chain for her. Um, and then in warning, you're warning me. <laughs> what are you warning me about? Type faster, Hikaru. <laughs> I'll wait, I'll wait, I'll drink some water. That's true. However, I don't have a however, you're not wrong. <laughs> Um, no, my real, however, is that um, we're not going to kill the, the assassin. We're not going to kill him. Um, what we're doing now is waiting for Spartacus to die. Nothing we do in the next three turns that I think it will take Spartacus, if not four turns, to die is going to kill uh, Yon King. Um, but you're right. That is the smart thing to, to, uh, to do here. So, if anything... Now we'll just we'll just do this. We'll just do this. Like I said, him being an assassin, uh, I don't remember the debuff on his MP, but even with class disadvantage, he's not going anywhere anytime soon. Wow, Sparkus took those pretty well. Oh, it's a damage cut from Waver. Um, we could run a quick chain here. But I think we should do a Spartacus chain on her instead. Buster Quick Arts. Uh, what if we got his MP again? We won't. But what if we did? Wow, what a what a bad MP game. Come on, take him out. No, take Spartacus out. Take Spartacus out. Um. Let's see here. You know what? Why not? Uh, actually, we can go ahead and do this. Yep. It'd be nice to save it for Sherlock, but uh, we want to start rolling that. Curse start gather rate, curse start drop rate. I think we want the gather rate right now. Um, actually, we can do both here and try to hit her fairly hard and we won't be stealing potential stars from homes what did we get 50 50 60 not bad but we're gonna load up her buster cards same i left blackbeard alive to the very end of the fight he barely survived on luck nice um we should get at least one crit here based on odds um we could get even more greedy here and use the cooldown on Waver for the extra attack up on her. If she crits twice, this is basically a Noble Phantasm. I think we're going to do that. I think we're going to go ahead and do this. This is super greedy, but why not? Because we we honestly have had crazy good luck so far. Um, yeah, so if she crits twice... This is going to be pretty big damage. So this is at 104 right now. Let's see what we get. We missed one. We missed two. We got that one. Oh, that was bigger than I thought it would be. So yeah, 104k gone. One crit hit. Uh, Spartacus was not supposed to be alive this long. He wasn't. I'm going to be honest. Uh, and we have, oh my gosh, this has gone absurdly well. This has gone absurdly well. I'm about to tell you why. We have 100% on both, oh my good lord. We have 100% on both Cat's cards. We have Cat's NP. We have crit up from Waver. We're going to use that on her. Spartacus was not supposed to still be here. Um... We're using the crit up on her. We're going to NP, quick, buster. 
we might clear out another bar for BB here. This is kind of nutty. This is kind of like dumb. Um, yeah, I, we're just uh, let Spartacus live. I mean, like I, I don't, <laughs> I, I can't do anything about it. Like, uh, waivers MP first. No, I don't want to do that because I want to get the chain. I want to use the uh, cat's chain here. Cause like. I mean, I'm literally just playing with house money here. There's no... I don't care about their NP because... I mean, my, my guy is waiting to come in, you know? Um, I mean, shoot. I guess to just kind of play it safe, I'll use this Invincible on Waver. Just to kind of play it safe. But, I mean, as, as we're about to see... I'm just going to let... I'm, I'm actually... I'm going to do this. Uh, yeah. Yeah. We're, you're you're going to see what I'm talking about. You're going to see what I'm talking about. <laughs> oh, man. If you don't play FGO and you don't know what's happened, that's Santa Claus in the Aztec goddess Quetzalcoatl's body. I butchered the true reason what's, like, what's happening there, but it's close enough. All right, so... Um, Yan King dies, and she is going to <laughs> obliterate BB. Yeah, that's why I was laughing because Yan King is gonna with, he died there. That's why I was laughing. Um, yeah, <laughs> this is this is like stupid good luck. Yes, she cleared out NPs. I don't care. We used. Uh, Kets is to just like nuke the map um and she went after the inv this is the best possible way this fight could have gone it's the best possible way like if you map out cards crits you name it this is like the best possible way i don't even yeah i didn't even need him can you please kill Spartacus? <laughs> what are you doing? Kill Spartacus. <laughs> okay, I guess. And what do we have here? We have a Buster Chain. I'm going to pull this back up. We have a Buster Chain. It has 100% stars on Quetzalcoatl. She's got Attack Up, Buster Up, Attack Up, Damage Plus, Critical Up, Critical up. Death is oppression. You're right, Ikaru. That is exactly what he would say. I'm not going to say that this will end the fight. <laughs> but there's a decent chance that this ends the fight. Oh my goodness. It's not going to end the fight. It's not going to end the fight. The revolution shall not die. Yes, bring me the Spartacus memes. Oh my god. <laughs> BB, I'm sorry. Like, you didn't even... There we go. All right, so he'll see the he'll see the field. He'll at least get to come in. Let Spartacus end the fight. Dude, yeah. I mean, he could have. Uh, so... BB, I'm sorry. This is actually not how it should have gone for you. Um, does he have... Yeah, he does. Oh, man. So, as you can see, uh, we're just going to end it with a buster and quick, quick. That was a... That went stupidly well. Like, I had these planes in my head that we were going to, like, generate stars on one turn... And then we would use Sherlock's NP, and then we would use the stars and his NP, and we were going to crit hard to clear out her first bar, by the way. My plan was to have him in to get to work critting on the first bar. We were going to do some kind of chain with cats on the second bar, and then the third bar would be like this knockdown drag out fight. Mozart didn't even see the field. I forgot about him. <laughs> Sherlock did a lot. Sherlock did nothing. Uh, 
Like, I'm not exaggerating. That's, that is the best RNG, the best card crit, everything that that fight uh, could have gone. Um, stared BB to death in the back row. Wow. I am uh, a little bit stunned by that fight. I'm a little bit stunned.